This dude in front of me, I'm trying to enjoy Grimm's birthday. He in front of me trying to get, because I was kind of loud. <laughs> he in front of me trying to replace the drinks with some food. Can I get an, a, another sandwich instead of the drink? How long he been going to McDonald's? Y'all, y'all tripping me. Y'all be tripping, man. How is he driving? I'm sorry. We've been here two, three minutes. She getting frustrated. And she gonna take that shit out on me. This dude was sent from hell to disrupt people's day. Lord, please don't let me take out my frustrations on this woman, cause who? He want a frappe. Why didn't he just say, let me substitute that for a frappe. I know it'll be an extra charge. Now she got to calm down from dealing with this nincompoop. We sitting there looking like. Thank you for choosing me. That was all you used on my today? Yes, ma'am. Okay. It'll be AF12. Anything else? No, ma'am, and God bless you, because you needed that. You need that blessing from dealing with that dude. I promise oh, exactly. you. Exactly. You heard that? Yeah, I heard you all heard we, that. We heard all of it. And I got people at my window, but you can come to the window. Okay. <laughs> Good grief. Now he up there fussing at the window. They're arguing. I kind of incited something, huh? I just said, God bless you. This don't make no sense. If she needs some help, I'll help her. I won't get no blood on my, my nice blue shirt, though. Did I say blood? Wait a minute. I'm escalating. I want to jump him. I ain't saying I believe in carjacking. Whew, good Lord, man. It don't make no sense. It don't make no sense. It don't. You need to find somebody else to play with, man. It don't make no sense. I'm just here to celebrate Grimace's birthday. That's all I'm trying to do. All I'm trying to do is celebrate Grimace's birthday. You had the mobile water? Yeah. Thank you, ma'am. Have a nice day. You too. <laughs> I, di I didn't want to bring it up no more with her because she, she kind of looked like Glorilla. Uh, and, and she had her purse on. So, no. <laughs> uh uh. You know, you know it, it, what people be carrying in their purse time. I ain't trying to make nobody no matter than they already are. I don't want to regret nothing. And my life is already filled with regrets. <laughs> I shut that up quickly. You hear me? She got blonde hair and she got long eyelashes and she had a purse on. Okay. You ain't playing in the drive-thru, huh? Okay, I just I just heard glow really in my head. I said, nah. She cool. Hey, how you doing? All right, how you doing? Yes, ma'am. Uh uh. Uh uh. Nah, and you work at a restaurant? How you yeah, gonna do that? <laughs> I did yesterday. Oh, okay. Mm. Good luck. Smell. <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. Can I ask? Never mind. I'm coming, I'm coming. Thank you. Mouth full of gold. She look like Juicy J. Yes, say hey. Mouth full of gold. God, no. Let me give me a job, McDonald's, man. I'm tripping. 
I ain't gonna get no gold, but I'm gonna get some, I'm gonna get some stuff that's valued at it. Hey, y'all. It's Grimace's birthday. ba da 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 Grimace. Let's get it. I'm back with another mukbang. Truck bang challenge. Come get you some. Bussin'. Mickey D's today. You're like, man, Gibbo, you just did a McDonald's uh, video a couple of weeks ago. Wait a minute. This is a special occasion. It's Grimace's birthday. Yeah. Happy birthday, Grimace. Can you see that? You see the shape. You ain't gonna see the right. Hey, happy birthday. Yeah. I feel corny. Yeah. Anyway, it's Grimace's birthday. I don't know what made him so special. Did Ronald McDonald ever get a birthday? Huh? Hey, did we ever celebrate your birthday? And I don't know how old he is, so don't ask. He like he about 200 with a very slow metabolism. Well, my McDonald's ain't been around that long. Maybe, maybe he about 50 and need to and need to walk every day. He need he ain't been putting his steps in. He okay, got the Big Mac, I guess. Big Mac was his favorite or some chicken nuggets, you get the either or. So I got a Big Mac, cause you know I ain't gonna go to McDonald's without getting me a Big Mac or that quarter pound of deluxe. Ooh, that was delicious. But then I got some, uh, well I'm tripping. I got some chicken nuggets. You get a choice of, you get a 10 piece chicken nugget or you get a Big Mac. So I got a 10 piece, I got a six piece chicken nugget and a Big Mac because, because it's his birthday and you get this shake. You get this Grimace birthday shake and you get some fries with the combo. Can't fall, we finna say grace and we finna get it in because I ain't got that much time today. I ain't got that much time. Come get you some. Amen. Amen again. And the reason I be turn I be I be forgetting to turn this down is because it's hot out here. It's hot out here, man. Yesterday, the other day was was it yesterday? Yesterday was 96 degrees, today is 80, but it's still hot. It feel like the devil out here doing yard work and told me to come help. And I was like, man, you tripping. Hey, Jesus, where you at? Anyway, I'm tripping. God, dog, chill out, boy. I'm tripping. I ain't crazy, though, I promise. Boy, did y'all hear that buffoonery going on in the drive? That was crazy. Y'all probably ain't hear him. But you, but you know I wasn't lying cause she was like, you hear that? Yeah, I heard that. And she did look like Glorilla and she had her purse. So I was like, nah, I ain't finna talk about it no more. Like she was ready to talk about it. I am, mm. I just like, mm -hmm. thank you for the receipt. I felt uncomfortable. We got that Big Mac, no pickles, extra Mac sauce. Please don't let me mess my shirt up. First bite, oh, so nice. Mmm. You probably be happy at a birthday party. It's my imaginary music plan. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I didn't even think about that. Drink, man, it's sweet. I said I was gonna cut sweets out. I got a small one just because it said Grimmy's birthday. I want to celebrate his birthday. I'm about to die. Good luck. I said, got me some drink, some regular.
Man, that's sweet. That's sweet in apple pie. It's good though, but I'm I'm over 45. I ain't supposed to be eating nothing like that, drinking nothing like that. Am I crazy? I told y'all before I was gonna cut out sugar. And you know, I wouldn't even think about it. And then I started tasting it. Sugar like a drug, man. I should, ooh, I just, all that that was in my head just washed away. Well, sugar boy, sugar do something to you. Hypnotize you. Praise you. Eating apple turnovers in the videos again. I turn, every time I see an apple turnover at a restaurant, let me get one of them. Three videos later, I'm back up to 250. I was doing good. I still intermittent fasting, but sugar and intermittent fasting don't miss. Let me tell you, I don't tell you what I was doing to work. I said I ain't gonna tell you, but I'm gonna tell you. I got these six pack Oreos, right? I don't think I should be saying this. Let's just say, <laughs> let's just say, I was eating Oreos every day for two weeks straight. About six of them. Cause I ain't finna get rolled up from the Oreos. I must told on myself. Oreo, my favorite cooking. You can keep the uh, soft baked, chewy cookies. I'm getting them Oreos with some milk, some chocolate milk. I'm fat. When it comes to Oreo, I don't care. I did a video last week. I like oh, oh no. I got to chill out. They was calling my name yesterday, though. I ain't eating them. I ain't eating them. I bet somebody $20. I'm going to eat them more Oreo for a week. I want my money too. I want my money. I'm popping these chicken nuggets in my mouth like Eminem. Boy, it's hiding his truck. Keep okay, up, I need a career change. Cause I do believe I'm tired of the restaurant business. When I say I'm tired, y'all say you all tired of something, you just don't feel like going in. When I say I'm tired, I mean I'm, I'm like sick of it. And I'm sick of the people. Not the guest, but just mm, some guest. And I appreciate the job, but I just say if you work around me, you better know what you're doing. And you better feel like being there. You hear me?
We got a little bitch last night. I'm like, I'm busy. We had people there that didn't know what they were doing. And we had people there that didn't want to be there. And had people there that could have helped out, but didn't. Then the power went off, because it was storming. So the system was down for a while. Hello, oh man. And there was a teacher's convention in the hotel. Teachers don't make that much money. So you know we're gonna get no tips, even though it's about a bunch of people in there. My thing is, if somebody asks you how much something costs, they can't afford it. How much is that? How much is that? Oh. How much is this? Oh, I was, I, was, I, was, I was smiling at the table when they asked me, how much is the, is the chef special? $45. You're going to get it. Ain't nothing on this menu under 15 so what you going to do? I still give them good service. But it's like going outside knowing you finna get shot. This is not gonna end well. And it didn't. Let me just get a salad and a bowl of soup. I said, so how about your second course? No. She wants a salad, I want the bowl of soup. That's dinner. Boy, this ain't I hot. Then the early bird special. I better get out of here. I'm sorry, but it's a Dairy Queen over there. I got family too. I ain't got a family. I got kids. I got Dairy Queen over there. I got another couple of restaurants that's not not exp expensive. Made this quick. First incident, we started getting busy. This old girl. Only reason she got hired there, because we had this old sorry manager coming there and just quit on us like that. And she was hiring people we knew wasn't gonna work out. Well, I knew wasn't gonna work out. And she quit and left the people that they hired there. So she come in there. She only worked like one or two days a week. We started getting busy. I shouldn't have run them out of hand now. My mom already angry. I ain't gonna make no money. She told me, uh, what's going on? I said, you mad because you getting busy? I know she ain't used to making this much money. So, whatever amount of money I make, to her is good. Because, but she mad because we getting busy. I said, girl, what's wrong with you? She said, uh, he said he was gonna send me home early. I said, girl, shut up. I told her, I said, shut up. I don't want to be here. I said, then quit. I said, you work one or two days a week. Man, get out of my face. I told you like that. Snap, just like that. I don't like nobody that's sorry. I don't like nobody that's sorry. I usually don't talk to people that's sorry, so she glad she got that snap from me. But I looked and I said, hey, man, did you say? She, this is the other dude I got an issue with. Did you say? Because he, he's incompetent. And I think, I don't believe nothing ever come out of his mouth. But he's a supervisor. I don't believe nothing ever come out of his mouth, though. I say, did you say she could leave early? He said, what I say? If you got to slow down and try to explain it in the middle of her, I said, don't worry about it. I said, she ain't going home. I told her like that. I said, she ain't going home. And we, got a room, we got a restaurant full of people. I don't know what you talking about. I ain't finna be doing it for no for those such and such amount of money I make? He said, well, she just had to do. I said, man, come on. I said, how long on a crispy salmon steak and what else was it? And some shrimp and grits. He said, it's coming up right now. 10 minutes went by. I said, how long on it? All the people wanted food. He said, it's coming up with plating and now. Another 10 minutes went by. I said, how long on it, man? He said, and he didn't say nothing. 
and keep him working on something else. And uh, another dude, another manager, he the manager, came up and he said, what you need, Dave? And I told him. And he had the salmon and the shrimp and grits came out. He's finna give it to me. And old buddy was like, no, no, that don't go with him. I say, give me that damn food. I said, give it to me. And he looked at me. He said, but we have other tickets before you. And I knew my ticket was next. I knew my ticket was the longest ticket up there. Boy, I went around the corner. I said, give me that food right there. And he looked at that ticket. He said, yeah, you right. I said, I know I'm right. <laughs> so I took it. And the manager, he sitting there looking at me, shaking his head and started laughing. Take that food at that table. Just incompetence. I don't like incompetence. I'm messing up this birthday party, but I got to visit somebody. So, then these people come in. They work for some judges. They work for some judges. And they was us. <laughs> they worked the dog out of me, boy. You hear me? I remember I had to make uh, Usher's uh, bouncer. Usher's bouncer, Usher's bodyguard, some fruit punch out of scratch, some fruit punch when he when I, at the old place I worked at, and he didn't tip me nothing. Usher ain't tip me nothing. And I had that feel about these people. They say they wanted some strawberry lemonade. First she said pink lemonade. I said she said do y'all have pink lemonade? I said yeah. I said we got some grenadine and some tropical lemonade. I said we'll get that for you. I thought I was doing good then. She said, well, can you muddle some strawberries in it? I said, girl, well, I look like a bartender. Huh? I like a table side bar service? You crazy? I said, yeah, okay. And then he was like, I'm allergic to, to shellfish, and she gonna eat your fries that came out of the shellfish grease. I said, you die, that's on you. I told everybody, hey, she die, that's on y'all. Y'all let this girl, anyway, they want about three or four of them lemonade. Can we get one to go? I said, boy, I feel, I just feel like this ain't gonna be right. I feel like I should get tipped to do something extra. They tip, but they ain't tip enough for me to be back there making strawberry lemonade. I say that to say while I was making the strawberry lemonade. Ooh, excuse me. Food and beverage director, sit that at the bar. What are you doing? Making strawberry lemonade. <laughs> How much is that gonna cost? I said, boy, you gonna get up and help? I promise. I said, man, you gonna get up and help or what? I said, cause I don't wanna hear it. If you ain't gonna get up and help, it's time me getting a job. It's time me for a whole career change. And he just looked at me like, if I feel I'm right, ain't nothing you can do about it. Ain't nothing you gonna say in that moment to, to appease me. Cause I'm gonna snap on you. Cause I feel like I ain't gonna say that on a, on open airways. I feel like I do a damn good job. And you sitting there watching me work. I ain't tell you anything you need. But shut up. Cause I'm, I'm inventing curse words. I'm inventing curse words in my head to say to you at that time. I mean, we was straight. He didn't get mad. But he didn't tell me he was mad. He he, he might have went and told them old. He said old mountains from the Caucasus buddies later on. But he didn't say that to me. Life has seasons. And it's time for my season to change, but I'm trying to tell you. It's like my temper's short. I don't like incompetence. Incompetence. I done messed his birthday party up. But yeah, I just want to vent, man. I just want to vent. I got nobody else to talk to. Oh, oh, oh and I got y'all right here. Y'all expect me to do something else? No. That's just a story I had to tell. Gotcha! I got fries all in my mouth. This is good, though. In this video, you see me, I'm going to look like Grimace. They'll probably be like, Negro, you look like Grimace now. Shut up. Hmm. I got to go to work. I should have said this in the beginning of the video. Please comment. Comment. Comment on if, if you like the video. Comment if you don't like the video. Comment, comment, comment. Like, like, like. It's like 90% of y'all <laughs> ask y'all to do something. You don't do it. It's all good. It's okay. It's okay. But I just comment. 
comment. Okay, cuss me out. Spam the comments out. Say whatever you want to say in the comment. If I done got on your nerve, if I done pissed you off, you put that in the comment. Just don't hit that dislike button because I don't trust it. It's like, it don't matter if it's dislike or it like. It's interaction. I don't, I don't trust it. I don't trust it. I don't trust it. You know, y'all know everything in the, on the up and up on this thing here. Hmm? Y'all know. TikTok. I'm going to say this to you. Okay. What's we'll up? My last two videos that I put up on TikTok. I put up. Boom, boom. Like, 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 like. It was like overran with likes. I was like, dang. Like 10 minutes had like 40 likes. That's good for me. I said, like, I'm finally going to get a decent TikTok video. Like 200 views in like 20 minutes. You, you know how many views it ended up having? About 250. Just three days ago, three, four days ago. I don't like it. t -top, if I see you on the streets, it's a problem. We gonna be moving furniture, you hear me? I just want a fair shot, man. It's something you ain't doing. It is another thing that I tried. I mean, it's all it's all red. That's how I feel. Y'all said it. I mean, I said it. I'm talking about y'all said it. I'm trying to blame somebody else. It's, it's, it's going down. If I see you in these streets, I promise. I can't, I can't win. I can't win with that now. You mean to tell me people just stop watching the video? They just stay like, yeah, and all of a sudden, like we had the Grimmer's birthday party. Everybody laughing and dancing and joking. And every side, people just stop and just go home and just get the hell on. Hmm? You ain't safe. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm talking about you now. I'm gonna talk about you now. I hope I get back to you. The fix is in over there. I don't care. I don't care. I ain't making no money in no type of way. Okay, I'm gonna I'm tell you how I really feel. You hear me? Hmm? Tita. I'm like, I used to get thousands and thousands of views and likes on Instagram, but I already tell you how I feel about that. Liz and Lou back. I see him. I see him. Liz and Lou type. Come back. Boom! People steady watching her. I'm trying to come back. Pew, 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 pew. It's all good though. You got to have a gift for this. But I'm just gonna talk shit till the end. You hear me? Grimace! What we doing now? Where the dollars at? Where the strippers at? Where the dollars at? It's your birthday. Where the dollars at? Where your toes at? You ain't seen them in years. I ain't, I don't think Grimmer's ever seen his toe. Where your toes at? Where your belt at? Where your mm at? Hmm? Where your mm at? Hey man, I'm tripping. I gotta go to work. But comment. <laughs> if y'all think that was stupid what I just did, comment on that too. I don't care. But uh, I'll see y'all next time. Stay safe, stay blessed. Stay kinfo. Bussin'.